and we're back. Game between Arizona and Vienna is very short. Be about to start here. Vienna will be in red and white, and Arizona will be in black. It is getting a little bit cooler here. Winds are picking up, as you can see from the American flag. It's a beautiful day out here, though, for some rugby. Very enjoyable. Vienna is getting ready to kick here, and we are underway. Short kick. That's fielded by Arizona. Good hard run to start the game from Arizona there. They go with the pick and go, the big boy. It's a hard tackle from Vienna though. Arizona got some numbers outside. Was trying to look to get that pass to the outside channels, but just couldn't get it down. Almost went to touch there. That was Vienna, but they managed to get the ball out, but it looks like we're going to go back to the knock-on. Scrum down right at the 40-yard line. This is good now. You know, Timmy, I think I think Arizona's pack looks a little bit bigger than yeah. the Yeah, they have a little bit of an advantage, as you can see there. Arizona was pushing Vienna around. Wow. But it looks like Vienna's got some speed. They got some fast and elusive runners. His number 15 is off to the races, and he is into the try zone. As we were just talking about it, number 15 from Vienna took off. Right under the bar. Made a nice one little move, and he was off. That was Cash. Ethan Cash. That was Ethan Cash on the score. You're gonna have to keep an eye on him in those outside channels, you know. He seems very elusive, very shifty. Kick was not good. 5-0, Vienna. Vienna goes with another short kick there. Arizona is able to recover it, but they are met very, very soon after that. And it looks like Vienna gets a poach here. They have numbers outside. Let's see if they use them again. They go out to number 15, and he is a speedster. He's running, and he gets caught on the sideline. Almost thought he was going to get in for another one there on the sideline. but Ethan Cash, he Ari is quick. Arizona was able to track him down and take him into touch. We're going to have a line out to Arizona here. Arizona is going with a three man. They're being matched by Vienna. Doesn't look like Vienna's going to be contesting this line out. They do not. Arizona wins the line out and then they go to a big boy and he is making a hard run here. Making himself hard to take down. He's still going. Wilkerson Dean feet. here carrying the ball. Took about half the team to take him down. You know, Timmy, I'm, I'm seeing the same thing I think I saw last game. Very powerful team versus very quick team. That is very true. Vienna with a lot of speed. A couple of guys who can make one move and beat you. But in these in these uh, six three man scrums, you see uh, yeah. Arizona's pushing Vienna around. I don't know, you know. Arizona definitely does have a lot of an advantage in these scrums. Arizona pushes them back, but doesn't have anything going in Vienna once again. Ethan Cash gets into the try zone. On that outside. 
think one of the things that Arizona is going to look at at halftime is those outside channels. Ethan Cash is exploiting that very hard right now. You know, Timmy, I, I wonder if that's why they call him Cash, because on the field, he's just money. Ah. <laughs> Kick is good there. That brings the score to 12 to 0 in favor of Vienna. Arizona has to be looking to keep the ball away from Ethan Cash. Man of the match so far with two tries. You know, I want to see Arizona hold possession here and see if they can hit those outside channels just as well as Vienna is. Vienna goes with a little bit of a deeper kick there. Big run from Matteo here. Arizona gets a little bit of space on the outside. He's making a move. He's got a good run there. He gets brought down by Vienna, but by William James. Up there in support. Quick tackle from Vienna there. This is a lot of bunched up play. Arizona should look to get the ball to the outside. <laughs> Number four, once again, with a strong run. Nobody can take him down. He's still moving. Once again, it takes about half of the team to tackle number four. That is Wilkinson Dean. Dean Wilkinson, sorry about that. Arizona there gets close to the try zone, but then they are stopped. Looks like they knocked it on right at the try line. Very close there. We're going to have a scrum down at the five, I believe, to Vienna. It's a half. Clock is winding down here. We've got about 20 seconds left in the half. Score rests at 12 to 0 in favor of Vienna. Once again, that Arizona scrum is just dominant. And Arizona is into the try zone after a one scrum. Excuse me. Uh, I did not see a call on that try there. May have been obstruction. The referee does look a little bit unhappy. Looks like he might have called obstruction there for running behind the scrum. Oh, so what happened was the uh, referee got in front of the defender, and that's why uh, Arizona was able to score, so he called it back. We'll see if uh, the Arizona pack continues to dominate the Vienna pack. It has been happening. Looks like Arizona knocked it on again, and Vienna gets another break. These risky offloads are causing a lot of ground ball, dirty ball. Both teams have to be really careful here. Obviously, if you're Arizona, you want to be able to get a score right at, before the half ends, but Vienna, you can't let this score get in. Vienna's holding them there. Right on this line, they're not pushing. Arizona is trying to power their way in. Oh. He gets called for a double move, and that's going to be halftime there. Very unfortunate for Arizona. Would have been a big swing of momentum for them. So, Tim, what do you, what do you think of these teams are going to go in and adjust uh, at halftime? I think one of the things that uh, Arizona is going to do is um, they really have to work on their outside channel coverage. Uh, they're getting exploited out there. I mean, as we've seen with Ethan Cash, he's been running down their throats. So that's one of the things that they have to do. And then Vienna, I think, I mean, it's... But that 
with that. Uh, Vienna wants to get that ball out wide to Ethan and their which, other which wingers. The, like what happened I think the referee, yeah. it's another uh, example of that though. big man versus fast man game. Yeah, no, the, he, and the, uh, got by the, the fast guys yeah. just keep ha having to exploit those outside channels. Yeah. yeah. I think if Vienna holds this uh, this aggression they got, they, they'll win. But you know, you never know if Arizona can come out and just fix what they've been doing wrong this half. back underway here in the second half. Vienna's receiving that ball and the first kick we've seen all day. Vienna boots that ball back right after the restart. Arizona here now got some space. Arizona's running. Vienna tries to go low on him but it was a hard tackle there. That was Matty Ocante on that big run there. The ball is stolen by Vienna though. Oh, a little bit of a high tackle there. Vienna's got some space outside. Let's see. Let's see what Ethan Cash can do. Already has two tries and that another is. high tackle. See a card here. More likely going to see a yellow card here. You can't do two of those in a row so blatantly. Ethan Cash looks a little bit shaken up, but he looks all right. Sir is talking to the Arizona players right now. Six. That was Pierce Ramos. That was going Pierce Ramos going to the sin bin. We'll spend two minutes in the shade there. Vienna now. Oh, oh Ethan Cash. Cash. He makes a move on that guy, and he is into the try zone again. That is his third try of the game. Seems like Vienna's entire game plan is just get him isolated, one-on-one, -on -one, two-on-one, and just let him go to work. Yeah, I mean, there was about two guys there that had, had an opportunity to tackle him, but he just he got around him. That kick there is no good. The score is currently 17 to 0, and that is in favor of Vienna. There's Ethan Heim on the kick there. Check, check, check. So you can hear that. Check, check. Nothing. Okay. Not but nothing when I talk here. Vienna here is ready to kick off the restart. They kick it short. That's fielded by number 11 on Arizona, though. He lowers his shoulder into that hit, but is met okay. by the Vienna tackler. It's not the next game. It's the game after, right? Vienna's going with the ball now, and that's number seven. He's down the sideline, and he's going to get into the try zone. That is Matthew Vojta. Once again, Vienna shows off their speed. Gets into the try zone. That brings the score to 22 to 0. We're going to have Ethan Heim on the kick again for Vienna. I think a Matthew there wanted to show Cash. He's not the only fast one on the team. Great oh, kick there Great for Ethan. Kick. Boot and a half. That brings the score to 24 to 0. There is. 
three minutes and 40 seconds left in the second half here. Arizona really has to make something happen here fit in fast. This broadcast is brought to you by St. Ignatius High School. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> Arizona on a hard carry there. Get the ruck over. Very low ruck. Hard tackle Holy by Vienna moly. there. Absolutely beautiful form tackle. That's a dagger right there. Arizona's got a little bit of space. He tried to get the offload off, but just could not do it. He's going to get called for a forward pass there. So close to breaking through the line there, but Arizona is just unlucky. Very smart move there, going for the arms on that uh, one on two. He knew he had to stop that pass, and great way to do it, forcing that forward ball. But they're just on time. Let's see how the Arizona pack does. Arizona pack wins it again. This pack is dominant for Arizona. Now they just need to do a little bit of scoring. Hard Ooh. tackle there. Absolute body slam. That is a penalty for not rolling there. Vienna Tackler was unable to get out of there. Wonderful kick to touch as well. I think that's the first time we've seen that all day. Somebody kicked a touch. We're going to have a line out for uh, Arizona here. They're pretty confident in their set piece, and they've shown it today too. They've won pretty much all their set pieces that they've uh, they've attempted. Look at that touch judging by uh, Sean Ward himself. Oh, he's got the bucket hat on now. This one was a bit too much for him to handle. Arizona goes short there. They got a big guy going. Arizona is into touch there on the sideline. They went short. Got it to their big guy. He just could not stay in bounds. And Sean Ward again. Second row, St. Ignatius High School. That ball was thrown to Cooper on a quick line out up front, and see if they try to do it again. The ball is back in possession of Arizona. That'll be called for not straight and not five. Vienna now gets the ball back. They're going to go on a quick tap, and they're going to boot the ball downfield. That was a perfect clearance. Vienna's really utilizing this kick. They could have had a great opportunity to score there, but they just couldn't get the right bounce there. That goes out of bounds into touch, and this is going to be a line out to Arizona once again. Arizona gets to use their uh, their best part of their arsenal, which seems to be their line out thus far. I would argue it's their scrum. Oh, scrum is well, dominant. Let us debate. That line out is a little bit of a dirty ball from Arizona, but it's won by Arizona and an absolute dominant tackle from Vienna there. A little bit of a dump tackle. What? What is... Uh, the whistle was blown there, but Vienna is still playing and gets into the try zone, I suppose. That's a score for Vienna. That it was... one of the quickest quick taps I've ever seen. Puts the quick in the quick tap. I'll, I'll do this one, yep. That was... Hey, Pat. Rangers. That, what a beautiful kick. That was Noah Kime on the kick again. Noah Kime. With a wonderful kick. The final score of this game was 31-0. to zero. The Vienna... Shut out. Congratulations to Vienna, who advances to our final later on today in Tier 2. Next up is our other Tier 2 semifinal, CRA and the Cleveland Rugby Academy against the Texas Rangers. We will see CRA versus Texas Rangers in the next semifinal game. Coming up right after this.